Well, you could almost put this scene on a postcard. Sun shining brightly as Anfield, absolutely perfect. My name is Derek Ray, and I'm joined for commentary by the former Arsenal and West Ham player Stuart Robson. And we've got Premier League action coming right up. It is Liverpool up against Aston Villa. Thanks, Derek. Well, both managers will be reminding their players of starting the game quickly, pinning the opposition back, playing the ball forward and regaining possession as quickly as possible. Hopefully, we get a really good game here. Let's take a look at the Liverpool starting eleven. Alisson gets the nod in goal. Andrew Robertson starts with Trent Alexander-Arnold in the fullback positions. And they line up with just the one striker looking to do a bit of damage. Here's how the lineup looks for Aston Villa. Emilio Martinez is the goalkeeper. Clément Longley plays with Diego Carlos in central defence. Douglas Luiz plays alongside Bubakar Camara in the centre of midfield. And leading the line today is Ollie Watkins. Number two, Joe Gomez. Number 32, Joe Matic. Number 26, Andrew Robertson. Thank you for attending Anfield. Enjoy the game. And now they get the ball rolling. So Bosloy, Trent Alexander-Arnold, regained possession. Now can they create something? Oh, marvellous goalkeeping. Well, it's a top-class save from a top-class goalkeeper. That's absolutely brilliant. He's driven in the corner. And a struggle to get it away properly. Nicely timed tackle. Well, I think, Stuart, you have to feel for any defender charged with the task of keeping Mo Salah quiet. He can be fantastic to watch. Well, he's su Salah! And a goal right off the bat. No wonder they're jumping for joy. Well, let's see this again. This is counter-attacking football at its very best. And then Salah's finish is brilliant. He strikes the ball cleanly and gives the keeper no time to react. It's a really good goal. So the match has restarted. 1-0 here. Watkins. It's with Camara. Couldn't keep it. A oh, terrific pass. And he's through. Well, here we can see it again. It's a beautifully weighted ball behind the back line. And once he gets onto it, he just smashes it past the keeper with great technique. What an emphatic finish that is. So back underway with the lead standing at 2-0. Physically strong and secure on the ball. An important interception. McGinn. Oh, good work by the keeper. Now sending it in. It comes to absolutely nothing. McGinn. Very quick thinking there. Trent Alexander-Arnold. Now Mo Salah. Luis Diaz. Alexander-Arnold. And he read it really well. Fine save. A 
how about the short corner? Just the challenge that was required. Ollie Watkins. Salah. Opportunity here. A goal! Another one! It's turning into an absolute demolition job. Well, here we can see it again, and it's all about the pace of the passing. One touch, slick movement, and then what a strike. That's hit with such ferocity. Certainly no stopping that. That's a great goal. This is looking rather comfortable for them. 3-0. Watkins. Well, there you have it. Liverpool have controlled most of the possession and have used it really well today, particularly in the midfield areas. And I expect more of the same as the game goes on. Now can they win back possession and create something else? An effective challenge. Opportunity! And the challenge, crisp and clean. Breaking at pace. Do they have the guile to open up the defence? Well, let's look at this again. To pick out this pass shows wonderful vision. It's inch perfect, and his movement's so clever. Once he gets onto it, there's only one thought in his head. Smash it as hard as possible. What a good goal. Blistering first half display, and just look at that score. Oh, the threat is there. Well, able to survive that attacking push. John McGinn. Luca Dean. McGinn. Cleared away. A chance then for the respective managers to address their charges. It is half-time here. Well, we're focusing on him for a reason. He's playing with real authority and attack, Stuart. Well, what can you say about him today? He's been a real live wire. Full of tricks, great feet and good goals as well. Top stuff. So back in business, and it was a breathtaking performance by Liverpool in the first 45, you've got to say. Mo Salah. And not cleared away properly. Well, they can bring it out now. Well, what a magnificent save that was. It really was top-class goalkeeping. Well, maybe a chance for them now to alleviate the pressure. Racing forward, trying to catch them out. Still alive. Unable to get himself back onside here. Well, he was always going to be offside. That was the wrong option. They will now make use of the substitutes bench. Alexis McAllister. So Bosloy. Gakpo. Salah. Nicely cut out. Zaniolo. And back with Tielemans. But he knew he had to get to the ball, and he did. Tielemans. An alert piece of defending. 
Alexander Arnold. So Bosloy. Alexander Arnold. Matip. Mo Salah. Might be able to get in behind the defence. Well, he didn't miss by all that much. Well, he struck it quite nicely, but the keeper was always in control of the situation. He knew that was going wide. Well, they've decided to make a change. Well, Liverpool have been really incisive today. Their movement, their passing and their end product has been far too much for the opponents here. Bubakar Kamara. Zaniolo. Digne. Kamara in position. Well, I'm afraid it goes down as a wasted opportunity. Well, no excuses. He should have scored there, and the goalkeeper got really lucky. He can't believe it. Please turn your lights off. Luis Diaz. He read the situation defensively and did his job. Not much defensive cover there on the flank. And he read it superbly. Can he find the right pass? A disappointing end to the move. Ten minutes left for play. Zaniolo. On to Tielemans. Can he make it count? Tenacious tackling. Excellent defending there. But he's gone short with it. Well, another corner following on from the last one. Let's see about the delivery. Attending to his defensive chores. Tielemans. And the challenge halts them in their tracks. Wataru Endo. Well, that's really strong play to keep hold of the ball. Well, totaling up all the stoppages, we'll have two additional minutes. Could be a chance to break here. A very effective clearance. And that is all for this game anyway. It goes into the books as a victory for Liverpool. You're absolutely right, Derek. Their attacking play was excellent, full of energy and pace, and the midfield completely dominated the game. It was a great all-round performance. But it just seems in this game, he's been a step ahead of his opponents in every way, Stuart. Well, he did everything today. His energy, skill and movement was just too good for those defenders. It was a really good display.